boy Drip, Drippy Mazda. I'm in the car right now. I'm driving to my buddy's house. We are going to install a custom carbon fiber air scoop to go behind my bumper. So, I'll show y'all what that looks like. This is gonna go behind the bumper. Got three holes. I'm gonna try to bolt it on. And here is the top air scoop that's gonna go under the hood. And it's gonna allow some more forced air induction to get into the air intake to the engine. So I'm gonna try to get a quick video of how to do it. Um, you gotta first take off the bumper. So that's a whole little process in itself. I'm not gonna post everything, but I'm gonna try to get it as much as I can. And we're gonna have to rearrange the driver's side horn to the passenger side. So we gotta figure that out. We also gonna have to cut a little bit of the plastic that's at the top so the air can guide up into the scoop and flow to the air intake. I have a short rim by Corksport, so you'll get to see that. And um, that's pretty much it, and we're gonna put it back together. So I'm just letting y'all know right now what's going on. I'll tap back in with you when I get to his house. All right, now we got the bumper off. Uh, check in the center. The horn. I don't think so. Trying to see where we could put this. We gotta figure out where that's gonna sit, and then if anything, we can use one of these holes. All right, so we figuring out where to mount this horn. This air scoop right here is gonna go just like that. And it's a bolt hole that can go right there. One bolt should be good. And once we get the horn mounted, we're gonna put it back together. And uh, we'll put the top part on. So, yep, that's how it's looking right now. All right, so first things first, we got the bumper off. Second, we had to remove this cover, which went right here. It's just three clips. You pop that off. Um, there's like a a hook on the back of the horn where you can loosen up. You gotta flip it around. And we tucked it behind right here and we bolted it up. So this is where the horn is newly mounted. And where the piece go? Now this will fit perfectly right here. And we're gonna do some cutting for the air to go through. And we'll get back to you. And when I used to work in a shop, Everything that like we took off of cars, if like let's say like you got new suspension or some shit like that, right. I keep your old bolts because you're not gonna need them. You know what I mean? And then I need them for future reference. Are you taking all of them home? I was just putting them in the box. I have a little drawer. Oh shit! Full of bolts. <laughs> it's looking snug now. I guess they did good with it. Yeah, Angry. they actually did. Yeah. They came out good. I don't want to like. Work this shit down and then it cracked your thing though. I mean, as long as it's on there. Yeah. They. I wonder why they put these extra holes. I thought you did that. No. <laughs> I, this is, I didn't touch this shit. It came in the mail. I just was looking at it. Alright. And then that goes on top. Yeah, we'll do that last. Okay. So, we so figure out where are we cutting? Okay, so. All right, real quick, uh, before I end the video, I just wanna say this thing works out great. 
you know, shipping. It came from China, so shipping was kind of slow. Um, when you mount this on here, make sure you slide it over to the hole to the left and not to the right, because every time you close the hood, it's gonna scratch this, and when it, and you gotta kind of like dig in with a Dremel and kind of give it a little more clearance, because this is gonna scratch every time you open and close the hood. So just make sure it's in the left hole and not the right hole. And um, overall, it works out great. I just want to show y'all real quickly what it looks like. Um, just a little push tap. And that's where the air comes in. Comes in. Go straight to the air intake. Right now I got the cork sport top off the box. But it works fine on or off. So that's what it looks like right now. And uh, that was the install. Y'all have a good one. I'm connected to the truth, so everything is going real smooth. Ooh, I don't know about you, but for me, everything is real smooth. Yeah, I speak the language. Smooth talk. Smooth talk. Yeah, I speak the language. Smooth talk. Smooth talk.